channel today is gonna be such an exciting day because we're going to new york for the first time ever i'm so excited um right now it's like around 5 a.m the sun has just risen baru sunrise study i'm heating up some brazilian cheese bread because i have nothing else to eat and then we are going to leave to the airport all my stuff is packed up i just need to weigh it to make sure it's not overweight a little overweight and then we are going to leave so i'll see you there at the airport i hope you enjoyed the vlog bye situation at the airport. Yeah, there's no problem. All guests and all zones have paid for the hotel. Thank you. Excited. Just arrived and we're gonna eat pizza. So hungry, let's go. Hello from Times Square. I'm staying at the Hilton Hotel in Times Square. Jadi keluar keluar udah langsung Times Square and it's really close to the pizza place that I'm gonna go to. Namanya Joe's Pizza. Jadi sekarang aku lagi jalan ke Joe's Pizza which is only a five minute walk from the hotel. It's a really famous pizza place, one of the most famous pizza places here in New York. Pas sampai di Joe's, aku ngantri untuk beli pizzanya and it was quite a line but the line was moving pretty fast so we only had to wait for like around eight minutes which was not bad. So much pizza, and this is so hot. It's so hot in here. So I ended up getting that. Then one slice is six and a half which is. Kayaknya kalau dirupiahin kita satu ribu. Let's see if it's really worth the hype. Yeah, I think that was pretty good. I would rate it like a nine out of ten. I think banyak orang bilang overrated karena mereka nggak coba ini yang tebel. There's pizza everywhere and trash everywhere too. This is pretty good. Sekarang aku mau jalan-jalan, and this is gonna be the first time I'm gonna ride the subway in New York. Sekarang bingung mau kemana. Every time I'm vlogging. I like hold my camera so tight because I'm scared like someone's gonna snatch it from me. My first time riding the subway. <laughs> oh my god, this is so confusing. Because this is my first time riding the subway, I feel like it's so hard to like navigate and actually get to your destination tanpa nyasar nyasar. Karena aku belum terbiasa kan naik subway, and this is also my first time here in New York. Anyway, this is what the subway station looks like in New York. There's a lot of people walking here, there, like everywhere, and there are often like performers, kayak orang lagi nyanyi nyanyi, nari nari, and sometimes there's some people like selling small snacks like gum and stuff like that. So my first impression of the subway is that it's not as dirty as people say it is um, aku dengar dari temen -temen aku that it's really smelly and dirty but it's actually not that bad so I think we're off to a good start this is our stop 23rd street and what I realized about New York is that there's so much construction going on and there's always like these metal thingies everywhere anyway sekarang aku lagi tunggu di bus station because I'm gonna ride the bus to Hudson River Park I swear I saw so many things tadi aja ada orang pingsan 
Karena ini pertama kali aku pakai public transportation atau busnya di New York. Aku nggak tahu tuh sistem pembayarannya tuh gimana. Aku kira bisa pakai Apple Pay, tinggal tap aja, tapi ternyata nggak bisa. Harus pakai cash atau nggak metro card, which I did not have. So I ran into the nearest train station and I purchased a metro card. Dan ini kena 34 dollar, which is around 500 Indonesian rupiah, sekitar 520 ribu kalau nggak salah. And then I used it to get a bus ticket. <laughs> Now we gotta wait four minutes for the bus. Akhirnya sampai juga di Hudson River Park dan di sini tuh barely ada apa-apa. There was nothing to see here. Jadi sekarang kita kayaknya mau langsung ke dinner aja. Kayaknya kalau aku datang pagian pasti lebih bagus sih kalau park kayak gini. Yeah. We spent 40 minutes trying to get to this park and we only spent like 5 minutes here. And now we're on the way to dinner at Sushi Bay. Kita lagi jalan ke sushi bayan. Man, we're gonna try this omakase. The only thing I had to do was pizza and cheese bread. This is Sushi by M, a popular omakase spot here in New York. Aku direkomend sama teman-teman aku. Apparently it's super worth it and super yummy. So I'm really excited to try it because I love Japanese food and sushi. Mm -hmm. I reserved a spot in advance, but I still had to wait around 10 to 15 minutes even though I came on time. And today I went with the 17 course menu. I'm just getting progressively redder throughout this whole video. <laughs> My ears were like freezing. Tadi kita makan 17 course di Sushi by M. It was so good. The person who served us was super nice. He was so funny. And then the food was also so good. Dan gak ada yang gak enak. I don't know. The atmosphere was just so cheerful. And everyone was so positive. Aku suka deh teman-teman kayak gitu. Sekarang jam 11. And I'm back at the hotel. This is the view from the hotel. Anyway, I decided that we would just stay home. Karena besok aku harus regis untuk kelas aku for the summer semester. So, I have to wake up pretty early tomorrow. Overall, today was so fun. And New York is actually way cleaner than I thought it would be. Soalnya semua orang bilang kotor banget. But actually, it wasn't as dirty as I thought it would be. I didn't get anything stolen today, which is good. Tadi aku pas nge-vlog kayak... Aku pegang tripodnya tuh udah kayak kenceng banget karena aku takut banget ada orang yang bakal ambil kamera aku. I'm like actually so scared someone's gonna snatch it. Soalnya tadi pas aku di Uber, the Uber driver said that there are so many like thieves in New York dan uh, kita harus waspada banget sama barang-barang kita biar nggak diambil orang. Okay, that's it for today's New York adventure. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. It's day two and I'm about to register for my classes. Nine minutes away. 
this is me failing to swipe the subway card which is so dumb but i ended up getting a hang of it eventually anyway hi guys today is day two and today we are going to Esa Bagel as our first stop. Jadi buat kalian yang gak tau, Esa Bagel is one of the most famous bagel places in New York. And it's comparable to the other famous bagel place, Ross and Daughters. Tapi katanya kalau gak mau ngantri lama, mendingan ke Esa Bagel aja. Sekarang aku lagi naik subway, mau ke sono. And as I told you guys before, there's sometimes performers on the subway. And this is one of them. Just got off our stop and now I'm walking to Esa Beagle which is just a short walk away from the subway station. Aku gak tau kalau suara aku kedengeran because it's so loud out here. Like what I realized is that New York is so loud and it's so hard to vlog here. <laughs> oh my god, I just passed this like super smelly area and it smelled so bad I literally can't. We're finally here at Esa Bagel. It's just right there. We were here at Esa Bagel. We have a lot of Mereka juga jual pastries. But I ordered the signature bagel yang ada salmonnya. Katanya enak banget kata teman aku. This is the signature salmon. No lettuce. Mm. Mm. So nice and sunny today. And now we're off to Central Park. Hari ini salah kostum sih. I'm wearing like these boots. And I'm so tired. <laughs> Finally in Central Park, but we only have 30 minutes to spare. Karena di sini aku mau nonton Moulin Rouge, which is a Broadway show, which I really, really, really wanted to watch since forever. So anyway, now we're at Central Park, and I just walked around for a bit because my feet were dying because of the boots and. It was very underwhelming because I didn't really get to the part of Central Park where people like to take photos in. Jadi ini cuma kaya park biasa menurut aku. And there were so many people walking their dogs. And it made me wish I had a dog, so... <laughs> I passed through this tunnel thing and then I saw a really cute dog. He was so cute. It was like a Shiba, I think. And it was so freaking chonky. Oh, I miss my dog so much. And then I just continued walking. So that's Central Park. And we're going to Mulan Rouge, Broadway show, which I'm so excited about. I'm so excited to see a show Broadway. And we're going to see Mulan Rouge. Sekarang di Times Square lagi karena aku bakal jalan dari Times Square ke tempat Broadway-nya because it's really near and this is the middle of Times Square. Super crowded, so many tourists taking pictures. This is my first time actually seeing the middle of Times Square so this was like kinda a wow moment for me. This is me rushing to the show karena aku takut pintunya udah ditutup dan aku gak bisa nonton show-nya dan tiket aku bakal hangus. So I rushed as fast as I could to the show and... We made it. What kalian yang gak tau Broadway show tuh seperti apa? It's like a musical, so they just perform and sing a lot of songs. And I just love watching shows like this. Jadi Moulin Rouge ini itu tentang this poet who moves to Paris to pursue his dreams. And while he was pursuing his dreams, he fell in love with this girl called Satine, who is a performer at this nightclub called the Moulin Rouge. Nah Moulin Rouge ini itu nightclub yang lagi kekurangan dana. Jadi mereka perlu investor, which is gonna be the Duke. So the I think the manager of the nightclub promises the Duke that he could get with Satine. Cerita ini bakal ada love triangle gitu. So the Satine girl has something that she's keeping from both of these men and the ending is super sad. So yeah, that's all I'm gonna say about it. Kalau kalian penasaran, nonton aja ya. But overall, it was such a good Broadway show and I would definitely watch it again. Mm -hmm.
just finished Mulan movies and it was so good. Sekarang aku lagi di hotel karena aku mau ganti sepatu. Aku tadi pakai boots. And my feet hurt so bad. So I went back to the hotel and I'm going to change my shoes. <laughs> Keluar-keluar hotel udah malam Terus sekarang aku lagi jalan ke Bryan Park Which is near the New York Public Library Yang aku pengen banget visit Katanya ini tempat yang sangat amat ikonik Which is why I'm going there Jadi ini kira-kira New York kalau malam tuh kayak gini So now I'm at Bryan Park Dan di sini tuh ada ice skating rink And there's some food stalls here Jadi aku pengen keliling-keliling Lihat ada apa aja di sini Jadi New York Public Library ini is actually in Bryant Park. It's that big building right there. I was walking around and this bow stall caught my eye. Jadi aku cobain pork belly bow mereka. And it looked so good but I didn't really like it because it's more on the sweeter side. Kalau kalian tahu aku gak gitu suka makanan yang terlalu manis. After I finished the bow, I quickly headed into the New York Public Library. It's really big and the building is so pretty. di New York Public Library tapi kita nggak bisa ke the library itself yang banyak buku itu karena kita harus ikut tour or we have to like study or research jadi kita lihat ini aja Thing is like so nice, and ini the first Winnie the Pooh. Agak horror nggak sih mukanya? <laughs> Beda banget ya sama yang sekarang. dinner and I'm riding a bus again to go to the dinner spot. I reserved a spot at Yakiniku Futago. Ini kayak Japanese barbecue gitu. Dan aku lihat Instagram orang ada yang post thick tongue mereka which looks so good. So I really wanted to try it. One of the UK. Oh, actually make the thicker beef tongue too. That's it for now. Yeah, I'll be free now. This was their UK which I really liked. I love the yolk and beef combination. Jadi tiap kali aku makan Japanese barbecue, aku selalu pesen UK. And this is their thick tongue which was really tender. This is their spicy bone marrow soup. If I'm not mistaken, it was also really good. I had it with crispy rice but the crispy rice wasn't really that good. And overall, I would rate it like an 8 out of 10. After that dinner, I headed back to the hotel. Terus aku ganti baju. Abis itu aku main mini golf di tempat ini namanya Swingers. It's like a place for mini golf, but it's also a bar, and it was really fun. It had really unique courses. Like one of them was like a Ferris wheel, and it was really hard for me to get it in the hole. But that's okay. I'm not very good at mini golf, but it was still really, really, really fun. I would definitely go again. Thirty to forty-five minutes to finish. 
finish all the holes i wish they had more because it was really fun to do and then i had a cocktail We're in Times Square again. Dan sekarang aku lagi beli makanan di Adele's Halal Food. Nih, okay. eh, food truck gitu bentuknya. Kayaknya sih enak banget karena banyak banget yang antri. My friend recommended this to me. Ini kayak halal guys gitu. Tada! Di sini tuh banyak banget food truck. Aku bakal take away terus makannya di hotel. This is the menu. This is my view. New York is so pretty. Kita di Adele di depan Radio City. Hey. Thank you. Finally back in the hotel room. Sekarang mau cobain Adele. We got a lamb garo and a lot of sauce, combo plate. Let's eat. Mm. Price is just soggy overall. 7.5 out of, out of 10. And here the spicy rice, yellow rice, lamb and chicken. Still. Devouring my Adele's. Ini lamnya enak banget. I changed my mind. It's not a 7 out of 10. It's like an 8.5. Hey guys, I forgot to record an outro, but thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you liked it. This is the first part of my New York series, and stay tuned for all the other videos. Bye-bye!